Hello everyone and welcome to the Wolf's Side channel. Today we have a very special topic. <laughs> Always special by the way. So this video is just a short reminder. No, I don't want to blame anyone. And this video is also dedicated to the people who were always saying, oh, I'm not improving, I'm not getting better. And to the other people who are saying, even if you want to play Mortal Online 2, then you have to play 24-7, otherwise you're a useless noob. No, I'm. Uh, that's, uh, this is exactly why I'm making this video, so please listen. This video footage is from a friend of mine and uh, a few guild members who, um, where they were outnumbered and they won the fight. They won the fight. Um, not particular because everyone is uh, good at PvP and stuff like this. They won the fight because they had good coordination during the fight. And that, that these people who fought there practiced as a group a lot of times. And if you want to win in small scale PvP fights and, and stuff like this, then skill and coordination matters a lot. In huge fights like 100 versus 100, coordination is very hard. I mean, I mean. Of course, of course, you also need some kind of coordination, but it's a little bit more forgiving if you're making coordination mistakes or if you're making um, calling mistakes and stuff like this. But in a small scale scenario where you're even outnumbered, it's it's very it's very tough to 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 make the right decision if if we, if we should to push, if we should to go backward, if if we should do this, if we should do that and stuff like that, because it's not so forgiving. And I want you to show you this video as a reminder that you should practice PvP with your guild. I mean, all you give, if you, for example, are a guild that doesn't do much PvP. I mean, it's a PvP game, so it would be good if you if you would make some PvP practice. If if, if you would at least once a week making making a PvP tournament uh, or whatever stuff. I mean, I mean, I mean, we basically have have a few of these in the week, and the the the, the, the most experience the guys uh, get is from is from real combat because we are in a, in a 24/7 PvP zone and it's hot here. All the time and th th this is also a way you can get better in the game uh, you can get better as a group in group fights if you really make pvp out there as a group i mean if you only practice uh, then you have good chances in tournament settings and stuff like this but in a real fight no one cares about rules and no one cares about anything and uh, you just need to win because because the real PvP fights are often not equal. I mean, in a tournament setting, you're fighting five versus five, but in in a, in Mortal Online, you're fighting three versus ten. You're fighting five versus five. You're fighting ten versus seven. You, whatever. You're you're fighting two two mages and and eight Thursas versus uh, I don't know ten Ogmias and two mages and whatever stuff. It's never equal. A fight is never equal in Mortal. It can't be equal because everyone has, has other other characters, other gear requirements, other gear, other materials, other pets, other whatever. So 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 so, so every fight in Mortal is not fair. And uh, this is the, the, this is the thing. You 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 have to improve as a group in your communication. I mean, individual skill also also matter a little bit in small scale PvP. It matters more than in large scale PvP. But in small scale PvP, also individual skill is would be awesome. Um, but but if if you for example someone who is only dueling 24/7, yeah, that uh, doesn't give you a lot of experience in a in particular for example this fight here. Uh, at least a little bit, but yeah. But in these fights, positioning is key and the coordination with your group who is standing there who is protecting this who is looking after that who is who is calling this who is doing that this is the, this is the key the key point of small scale pvp and yeah a lot of people always claim oh it's it's a only gear game no it's not the only gear game if it's only a gear game then people with with high end equipment would win all the time i know they not win all the time because if you have better skills you can defeat anyone and the other thing is you can only get better if you are also taking fights when you, for example, you know the others have more people, but you're engaging the fight anyway because you're having fun to fight. You're having not particular fun to die, but you can only learn from experience that are getting harder and harder and harder all the time. I mean, if you, just to give you a brief example, if you would only fight people that that that, that joined the game two weeks ago, you will never get better. Doesn't matter how many fights you take. Versus people that have that have uh, uh, very low experience in the game, even if they have talent. But 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 if if you're fighting if you're fighting hardcore people that are fighting a lot a lot of hours a day, constantly making PvP, and you're fighting versus them, a lot of times you will get better and better and better and better, and then after a few years or even after a few months, even after a few months, 
you will see a significant increase in your skills. And then, then we are fight when you when you were fighting other pros, where you thought, oh, I, I I'm never, I'm, I'm, I will be never this good, never in my life I will be this good. Then, then you are at that point. You will be at some point. You will be at that point if you keep making PvP, if you keep fighting, if you keep playing. And this is one of the video examples I picked. And again and again, it's not here to blame Gokturk. Actually, respect to Gokturk. Was a nice fight. Awesome. And and please, 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 guys, yeah. In Mortal Kombat, please respect your opponent. We are all people sitting in front of a PC and have, want to have fun in the game. So, so why not respect each other a little bit more maybe? That would be awesome. And when people are now saying, but, but wars can only be won by numbers and, 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 uh, and you need a, a, a hardcore group who's, who's fighting all day, 12 hours a day, making PvP. No, I'm not saying that. I'm not saying that. And I'm not saying that, that you need that. We have, we have one of our, of our very good PvP players is only making PvP one or two hours a day. One or two hours a day. But he's constantly learning from his mistakes and he's getting better and better. Then you also need less time. You also need less time if you if you think a little bit more through what you learned today. So you can also be a casual player and a very good PvP player. Because I have the best example. The best example is talking to you right now. I played so much Mortal Online 1 to death. I played it so much. And I can't fight. I'm I'm uh, uh, the Mortal Online one. I was, I was maybe, maybe medio core, maybe a little bit more than medio core, uh, maybe, yeah. And and and, and the Mortal Online two, I'm I'm below medio core. I I I'm really below medio core, because because I play far 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 less because I have I have other shit to do all the time. But the thing is, the thing is, the thing is, there are also people in the game who are playing since years or stuff like this. And are and are not getting better because 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 they are doing uh, they are doing it not constantly. If you if you're playing hardcore for three months, then at the end of the three months you're maybe maybe a, a lot better. Um, but then you're quitting the game for I don't know how many months. Then you're playing it again, and uh, then then you are not as good as someone who has just invested a few hours each day, each day or each week, a few days each time. The, the, the consistency, the consistency and the self-discipline is the, is, the, is the rewarding factor for mortal. Or you are completely untalented like me and you are very untalented, for example, like me for years and stuff like this. Then you should maybe focus not, not on getting, being the best PvP player, but maybe, be, maybe uh, being the best, I don't know, the best healer mage. Being, being the best in whatever stuff, the best in, in, in uh, getting shit done for your guild or the best in organizing stuff or the best in whatever stuff. You can be, ju just search other fields, M maybe maybe it's a lot more rewarding for you. Shit, I, I did, did, didn't, want to, didn't want to demotivate uh, people, I, I just wanted to motivate you all, but I don't know if that is, I, I, I stopped talking. So uh, thank you for watching. And uh, please leave a like and subscribe, would be really awesome by the way. And don't forget to ring the bell and practice fighting! Special thanks to all the supporters, of course. Carmel, Professor Olo, Gary Ronos, Spartanax, Colombo, Giovanni Vargas, Real Map, Bushman, Greta, you and all the others, of course. And don't forget to practice your party hard. Uh, make party hard, make party hard. <laughs> uh, and um, um, yeah, uh, see you all next time. Goodbye!